the time to enjoy yourself is in the now. In the moment of whatever it is that you are trying to achieve. It starts as soon as you open up your eyes in the morning or whenever it is that you start the day. As soon as you open up your eyes to greet the day, you enter into consciousness. It is at that moment that your creativity is at its most powerful. Right there and then, you have an opportunity to steer your thoughts and your emotions in the direction that you want them to go, not in the direction that they're telling you to go. In other words, you can literally choose to seize the day or you can let the day seize you. As soon as you open up your eyes to start the day is to immediately start focusing on something or someone that you are totally grateful for in your life. I don't care what it is or who it is, but I want you to feel it with your heart and soul. Your only goal as soon as you open up your eyes is to be to make yourself feel good and to give yourself enough confidence to get through the day. Don't worry about what needs to be done. Think about who you have to be in order to get it done. And you do this by focusing on all the things that you're grateful for. Focus on what's working in your life rather than fixating on what isn't working. Maybe you're grateful for the person that's lying next to you. Maybe you're thinking of your children. Maybe it's a dog lying on the side of your bed. Maybe you're listening to the birds outside your window. It's the wonderful house you live in. Maybe it's the wonderful organization that you belong to. It doesn't matter what it is. You just feel it with your heart and soul. You build from there and you keep going. Why do I want you to do this? Because gratitude is the most powerful connection you have to your higher self. You always, always want to start your day connected to this higher self. And when you do, when you do, life becomes easier. You don't take things personally. When you're confronted with a challenge, you just look at it for what it's worth. It's a challenge. Everybody's confronted with challenges. And you know that there's something within you that can meet it and overcome it and move forward as a result of it. Tell yourself you're going to enjoy the day. Say it to yourself, you know what, I'm going to enjoy the day. This is going to be a good day. Visualize how you want your life to go. Visualize yourself having fun with your fellow workers, the people you're working for who are working for you. Doesn't matter. Just visualize yourself achieving the goal. And always, always find the laughter within you and around you every day of your life. And that should start in the morning before you leave the house. There's humor all around you. We get so caught up in our thought process and what needs to be done. We let all the funny stuff in our lives just pass us by. Another thing that can put you in a great mood every day, do something nice to somebody. Do something nice to somebody. There's nothing that can bounce you back to enjoy the day than that. All these things that I am telling you is giving you a different thought process, a different focus to look at life from a different perspective. And our lives move in the direction of our most dominant thoughts and what we focus on day in and day out. Not only do our lives move in the direction of what we focus on and what we think about, but those very things that we're thinking about and focusing on are moving closer to us. In other words, people, the more you focus on your lack, the more of that you're going to get back. Because people, when you start laughing at a negative, intense, stressful, overwhelming situation like that, your brain is no longer focusing on that negative situation. Your brain can only focus on one thing at a time. Right now, your brain is laughing at something ridiculous that you just did. And even if your brain did go back to that negative situation, which it will do eventually, but guess what? It won't be as overwhelming as it was before because you've calmed your nervous system down to the point where you can control the situation instead of having that situation control you.